Breaking news! Another old discovery turned out to be new. Meet Kankulu mongoliensis, a new tyrannosauroid from the late Cretaceous Mongolia in the Bayan Shire Formation around 96 to 89 million years ago. Two specimens were discovered between 1972 and 73. They were originally thought to be Alectrosaurus, another poorly known tyrannosauroid, but when co-author Jared Voritz studied the bones during a research trip in 2023, he realized they were something new. Kankulu was an early tyrannosauroid but had a mixture of advanced tyrannosaurid traits and primitive tyrannosauroid traits too. It was pretty close to tyrannosaurids, but not quite enough. It was a speedy predator with long legs. It stands at around 2 meters tall and 6 meters long, and showed signs of being an adult specimen. The skull shares some similar traits to juvenile tyrannosaurids. It has a rough and bumpy nasal, but a smooth lacrimal bone, and fewer bumpy horns around the eye sockets. The teeth were more numerous but flatter and blade-like, unlike tyrannosaurids. The humerus and finger bones were missing, but based on earlier descriptions, it had large finger claws. This study believes that early small tyrannosauroids migrated into North America, evolved into big tyrannosaurids, and migrated back to Asia, where they split into the small and agile long-snouted Allioramini and the massive Tarbosaurus. Viewers might also remember I reported another dinosaur from the Bayan Shire Formation a few months ago. Kankulu shared its habitat with Duonychus. If you missed it, you can check out this bit of news to learn more about it.